Hey there, Rodrigo here for Textualize and in this short video I want to show you how you can create an input field that provides auto-completion suggestions. suggestions. So if I run the application I have at hand, it's just an input field with nothing in it. And now what I want to do is I want to take this input field and I want to show input suggestions when the user starts to type. So let's pretend that this input field is for the user to type in the country they're from. So let's type in a couple of countries, so Portugal, let's go with Scotland now, and also Spain. And now what I'll show you is that there's a textual dot suggest suggestions, and from there you can import the suggest, sorry, wrong one, suggester, so textual dot suggester, you can import suggest from list. And when you yield your input, you can set the suggester to be an instance of this suggest from list class. And you just give it the list of countries. So in the general case, the list with the possible completions. And now when you run your application, when you start to type, the input will provide suggestions according to what you've typed. So if I type a E, you can see the Portugal written in a faint... Um, in a fainted color, and if I press the right arrow, then it auto completes. Now, let's see, can I show you the right arrow though? Keycaster, let's see very quickly. Preferences, I thought this was turned on, but apparently not. Okay, so when I press right, it auto completes. Now, obviously, if I type something that doesn't match any of the countries, then it shows nothing. And if I type the uppercase S, it's going to start with Scotland because it's respects the order of the list, but then if I put AP there, then it's going to complete Spain, obviously. And also, by default, it is case-sensitive. So P-O-R-T does not autocomplete Portugal because of the P. However, you can change this. You just go to your suggest from list, and when you instantiate it, you change the value of case-sensitive to false. So it's no longer case-sensitive. You can run it. You can type P ortu and you can change the casing you can go absolutely crazy but when you press right it will auto complete with the value that was in the list all right so the list was written portugal is capitalized in the let's say correct way or in the standard way and so when you auto complete it the casing will be replaced with the option that you accepted so this is how you can provide basic auto-completion features. I'll leave a, doc, a documentation link below. And if you have any questions, just join our Discord server and ask away. I hope this was helpful. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.